Hey guys, it's Kara. Um, I'm here to do kind of like really fast book reviews, um, three of them, and then well first I'm going to tell you what I've been reading, and then maybe give you like an update or two, and all that fun stuff. So, okay, so the first thing I want to talk about is that I finished reading The Last Olympian by Rick Riordan, which is the fifth and final book in the Percy Jackson series. And I actually have the series with me. The first one is The Lightning Thief. And then, uh, see if Monsters, which you guys probably already know all of this. Titan's Curse, Battle of the Labyrinth. And then the last one, which is The Last Olympian, which is awesome. Okay, so I just wanted to talk about these really fast. The first one was made into a movie, which I saw the movie first, and then I decided to read the book. And the book was way, way, way better. Like, way better. So I recommend that you read the book instead of watching the movie. Well, watch the movie, but after you've read the book. Um, so yeah, and then actually they just kept getting better and better and better. And I think the, my favorite um, one in the whole series is Battle of the Labyrinth. Because that one was really cool. So the fifth one was good too, but Battle of the Labyrinth is really good. Um, so yeah, I recommend reading all of those. Um, the next book that I read was Insurgent by Veronica Roth, which is the sequel to Divergent. And I'm, I don't really want to get into the whole plot just because for those of you who haven't read Divergent or for those of you who, have, who haven't read Insurgent, I don't want to ruin anything for you. So basically, I'm just going to say that it wasn't as good as, Di as Divergent was, but I thoroughly enjoyed it and I still gave it 5 out of 5 so if you're you know because there's been a lot of split reviews on this book so if you're not sure exactly what to think of it just know that I thought it was really good so there's that okay and then the next book that I read this month was Shatter Me by Tahara Mafi and this book is about a girl who can't touch people because she'll kill them if she dies and it's, that's basically all you need to know going into it. Um, there's romance in it, which I liked, because it, it's not kind of like the, the very um, toned-down romance that you see in a lot of YA novels nowadays. It's very, like, when I was reading it, I was like, ooh, this is scandalous, or, you know, whatever. So it's a lot, it's a lot steamier in the book than, than a lot of other books. So I thought that was a nice, because, you know, I'm 19, so I can handle that kind of stuff. But other than that, the story was great. Um, it had all the qualities that I like reading, you know, in books. Like the heroine was not whiny. She was the right, the perfect blend of like somber, but not being like bitching. You know what I'm saying? Which was really refreshing because I don't like one of my biggest pet peeves in books is when the main girl character is just like. Why do people like me? I suck. Um, and it's just and the same thing with Insurgent. A lot of people think that um, the main character in Insurgent kind of got a little bit, you know, whiny. But I think, I mean, because of what she's going through, what do you expect? You know, like she's not being whiny for no reason. Okay, it's hot in here, so I'm gonna take off my jacket. It was cold, now it's hot. Um, okay, put that there. The and then so those were the only three books I've read this month so far. But I'm reading three other ones right now. My goal is to reach ten books this month, which I don't think I've ever done. But let's let's hope. Okay, so the first book that I'm reading, I actually got from from a woman who works at my college. Uh, she lent it to me because she knew how much I like to read, and she actually wrote one of her. She she got a master's degree, so I think she wrote like some thesis on this book or something. But it is a selection of nine stories, and it's actually called Nine Stories, and it is by J.D. Salinger, who I believe also wrote Catcher in the Rye, but, uh, no, not Catcher in the Rye. I don't know. He wrote something else, but I cannot think of what it is. Okay, and then, oh, and I'm like halfway done, so yeah. The next book that I'm reading is The Maze Runner. Did I mention that I gave all those books that I just reviewed 5 out of 5 stars? I don't know if I did, but I gave every single one of them 5 out of 5 stars. This one I can already tell is going to be getting 5 out of 5 stars from me because it is fantastic. It is 
very action packed and the <clears throat> excuse me the plot is um it's just it's awesome like it's so creative and I'm about two thirds the way through so hopefully I'll finish this today or tomorrow yes and then the last book that I'm reading is by Jackson Pierce and it is Sweetly there you go Sweetly which is a retelling of Hansel and Gretel and I'm I'm only on page 87 out of 310 so not that far. Hopefully I'll finish this one soon too. And I hope. And yes, so just I'll be posting reviews about all the books that I read. Probably just like this where there'll be collect collective reviews. Um yes. So <laughs> anyway, I'm out of school so now I can actually read. Yes, finals were really hard, but Thank goodness they're over. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'll see you guys later. Bye.